I believe that art is about freedom of expression. And this show demonstrates that Picasso's freedom from style and thematic restraints still influences contemporary artists to this day. People often ask me who is the geometric artist that has the greatest influence on me, and they expect me to say Malevich or Mondrian. And I always say my favorite geometric painter is Picasso. I love all periods of Picasso's work, but I find the late work so meaningful because uh, Picasso achieves so much, and he is so generous in giving that information to every human being. He just makes incredible paintings. It was such a revolution. I really think it's important to, to try to continue this dialogue with Picasso. He really invented a language, and I feel that now part of my vocabulary is borrowed from the Cubism. Picasso's work is with us right at this moment, at the same level of freshness that it was that moment that he made it. The Echo of Picasso, it's a wonderful show. It's fantastic in that it lets all of us to be in dialogue with Picasso's work. The Echo of Picasso show has two perspectives, one about historical artists and one about living artists who are influenced by Picasso work. The show is curated by Eric Troncy, who is the director of a Consortium Museum in Dijon. And this transgenerational show, it gives different perspectives on Picasso's influence today. It's really alive.